Alright, so got the lines unhooked, your ground unhooked, and of course there's supposed to be a plug that goes to that. Looks like I really fucked up. I uh, didn't pay attention on lowering the tank. I was thinking this would come down with it, and it didn't. Looks like I'll be spending more than 11 bucks now. Unless, well, we'll see. Because that's supposed to be like specialized coated, so when you had them wires connected, um, there's no sparks that will go down in there and blow you up. I don't know, fuck. I've dropped cigarettes on open gasoline, it didn't fucking blow up, so. Fuck it. I catch fire and blow up, I catch fire and blow up, and I mean, it's on the driver's side. <sighs> I'm supposed to have this truck going by winter. I mean, who doesn't want to try out some badass tires like that in the fucking snow, right? Alright. Well, you guys uh, sit back here and you will end up watching me uh, <laughs> um, drag the tank out miraculously. I hope uh, if I fucking phone a stay and show you, maybe can't promise you anything. I don't even know if you guys are able to see this or if you didn't see my ass crack. This has a lot of gas in it, so. Gotta go slow, go real slow. think you're fucking man enough to handle a full fucking tank, go ahead. Uh, you know how heavy a five gallon tank is? Uh, that's about three quarters of a tank. And uh, I'm going to try and rig something up so I can uh, funnel some of the gas back into that. Uh, it's a little small. <laughs> but uh maybe hopefully with a little fucking luck and a little bit of dirt in the gas and I got a little plan on bending this like that is I don't know how much gas is gonna come shooting out of those. But uh what I really like to do is just get this cleaned off as soon as I fucking can. Supposedly have rain coming. But uh everybody's like just you know cut a hole in the box. Just cut a hole in the box. You can always patch it. You can always cut a hole in the box. Why are you stupid fucks? The reason why I don't cut a hole in the fucking box is because the fuel pump comes right up, right underneath the fucking cab in the back of it. <sighs> you can cut a fucking hole in the fucking box so you fucking want, right? But when you cut the hole in the box, it's gonna be right here, right? And you're gonna have to cut this fucking thing out of your way. You see, this comes down. You have to cut that out of your way, right? Right? The fuel pump rests right about in this fucking area. There is no fucking way you're gonna cut a hole in the fucking box to access it. Okay? 
Do you understand what I'm saying now? Do I have to speak it in Chinese, Japanese, fucking English, Dutch, whatever fucking language to please you? <sighs> Rant over. But, just for showing you that you're wrong. You cannot lift the box. You cannot cut a hole in the fucking box. Maybe you can in 88 Chevys, all the way up to fucking, who knows, 2015s. Who knows, 2020s. You could probably always be able to cut a hole in the fucking box. But from, I don't know, let's say 80 to fucking 87, the fucking fuel pump went under the cab. Yeah. That's the end of my fucking rant. And you already know what I got going on with that. <laughs>